The mask mandate came to an end effective today in St. Louis City. News 11's Ty Hawkins spoke to people in the Central West End this morning who say wearing a mask moving forward is really a personal choice. The mask mandate has officially been lifted in the city of St. Louis. I spoke to people who say this is great news, but they also say they respect people's decision to keep wearing one. I think it's, yeah, your own decision if you want to. If you want to, if you don't, you don't. Now you don't really have to, you don't have to because they didn't lift the mask mandate. That, I was just thinking that driving here, I'm like, what if I don't have a mask? But then I'm like, I think they just lifted it today or something like that, so. Brianna Barnes was right. The mask mandate in St. Louis City was lifted Sunday. She says she thinks people should have had the choice all along. At seven months pregnant, expecting her firstborn though, she still wears a mask inside. Like if I was to catch it, it's like 10 times worse than the average person catching it, you know, because I have to worry about me and my feeble sack, so. Andrew Hagopian was in St. Louis from Edwardsville on a staycation. Like Barnes, he's going to keep wearing his mask for his family. Once our family members are kind of beyond their their current conditions, then we'll be, you know, we'll be at that point. In fact, he doesn't mind if there is or isn't a mandate. So for us, we're wearing one regardless. Uh, you know, I'm not against or for the masking. So honestly, I'm in the middle when it comes to that. Carlos Gonzalez of Atlanta, Georgia, was passing through on tour with his band on the way to Tulsa, Oklahoma. Like Barnes and similar to Hagopian, Gonzalez thinks it's a personal choice. If there is a mask mandate that's lifted, we'll always try to like, you know, protect ourselves inside and wear masks um, to do our part. But at the same time, if others, you know, choose that they want to do that, that is their personal choice. After a challenging time, though, he admits seeing the smiling faces in St. Louis was welcoming. It is kind of nice to get back out on the road and see like a return to normalcy, if you will. In Central West End, Ty Hawkins, 